This is a Rubik's clock. It is a two-sided puzzle containing gears and pins. It is controlled by twisting the corners. If all the pins are up and I turn a corner, all the clocks spin at once. If only one pin is up, the clocks around it spin. If all the pins are down, only the corners spin. Let's see how this works. There are two clear plastic shells, two cardboard color panels, and two black plastic shells holding everything in place. The center and edge clocks are actually two pieces that spin independently. The spring presses the two pieces against the black shell, holding them in place. The pins move up and down these gears, changing which ones spin. If the pin is up, it will spin the top set of gears. If the pin is down, it will spin the bottom set of gears. This puzzle has an interesting mechanism to click the gears into place. On the black shell, there are bumps that when the gears move over them, take more force to move. That extra force makes the clocks snap into place. Now you know how this fun puzzle works.